Hello! In this week's video, we'll be talking about texture, and we've included some examples of accepted student art portfolio pieces where they successfully use texture. In the visual arts, there are two different types of texture, implied texture and tactile texture. Implied texture is when we use drawing or painting to show the way the surface of something looks like it feels. Implied texture is created using line, mark making, shape, and shading. Tactile texture or physical texture is the way a surface actually feels, created through methods such as cutting, building, tearing, or layering of materials. With implied texture, you're using your skills as an artist to create an illusion. You're creating the illusion of fur or glass or a flower petal. With tactile texture, you're adding the fur or glass or flower petal or creating a texture that you can actually feel when you touch it. Basically, the materials used give the piece texture. In both cases, it's your choice as an artist to use any texture, implied or physical, to convey a message or feeling to the viewer. Using texture in art can, it can invoke feelings of contentment, discomfort, or familiarity. Textures are described by many different adjectives. We commonly think of the adjectives rough and smooth, but there are many more. Try creating an art portfolio piece based on a more obscure adjective like abrasive, angular, bouncy, bendable, cozy, dry, flawed, furry, fuzzy, gooey, glossy. You get the idea. Start by writing down a word in your sketchbook and see what ideas and visuals you come up with. If you need help working on your portfolio, Ashcan's portfolio prep classes are a great place to start. We have online classes now, so no matter where you are, you can develop your skills and ideas with the guidance of our outstanding teachers and programs.